All right, this is Mr. Barr, and this is Full Triangle Proofs Day 1. Remember, you're going to be expected to write this all down in your notebook. Otherwise, you need to print this out, and then you can write it on this page. So draw the figures, write it down, uh, mark up the document or the figures, uh, show all the statements and reasons, be tidy and organized. Okay, here's our first one. We're going to do a full proof. Now, here's the deal. Your order might be a little bit different from my order, but overall it should be very similar. So I'm going to put all my givens down here right now. I've got my three givens here, and I'm going to just get those givens into this statement. So A, B is congruent to D, E. B, C is congruent to E, F. Angle B is congruent to angle E. How do I know all this stuff? They're all givens. And notice that the drawings are already marked up for me, so that's good. And now I can prove the two triangles are congruent. Side, angle, side, side, angle, side. And I'm just using the proofs that were given to me. So triangle ABC is congruent to triangle DEF. How do I know? Side, angle, side. Okay, let's go do this one. Full triangle proofs. Okay, I've read the instructions and I realized that if I don't follow the instructions, I will get marked down. Let's check it. What do I have? A, B, D, E. B, C, E, F. B, E, A, B, C, D, E, F. Side, angle, side. Perfect. I've checked my work. I'm happy with it. Going on to the next one. Number three. Going to start by getting those three givens into the proof. PQ, TU. Got it? And now notice the triangles are already marked up, so it's angle, side, angle angle side angle and that's what we're trying to prove so triangle PQR is congruent to angle TUS by angle side angle PQ TU PQ TU P to T Q to U given 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 ASA PQR T-U-S, looks good to me. All right, I'm back. I just paused it. I have no idea where I'm at on this. Nope. I guess I was looking at... Give me a second. Okay, um... I guess I'm on to the next one, number four. What did I just do? I just did number three. Okay, I'm on to number four. Here we go, number four. I've got a couple givens, so let's get those givens in there right now. J, K, M, N. K L N O uh, J and M are right angles. Um I'm going to put that J and M are congruent. Angle J 
is congruent to angle M, all right angles are congruent. And then I'm going to say the two triangles are congruent by hypotenuse leg. Okay, let's see if that's a good one. This one right here, I'll, let's see if I put that in my answer key. Yeah, um, so I didn't have that in my answer key, but it's still a good proof, I think. All right, I'm happy with that. Let's go to number five. Oh my goodness, I like this one. You're gonna like this one too, side, side, side. AB is congruent to DF. BC is congruent to DE. AC is congruent to EF. Given, given, given. How do I know the two triangles are congruent? ABD. FDE by side, side, side. ABD, AB. Whoa, those don't make any sense. This doesn't make sense. This proof needs to be fixed. It needs to be ABC, ABC, FDE. So I need to fix that to a C, ABC. I'll fix that. A, B, D, so be A, B, C right there. So A, B, D, F, B, C, D, E, A, C, E, F. This should be A, B, C is congruent to F, D, E by side, side, side. Okay, I'll have to fix that one, no problem. Number six. Angle P is congruent to angle S. Angle Q is congruent to angle T. Segment QR is congruent to segment TU. Those are all givens. All right, and it looks like I've got the two triangles. Triangle PQR. PQR is congruent to STU by angle, angle, side. Let's check it. P to S, Q to T, QR, TU, PQR, STU, AAS, given, given, given. Looks good. And question number seven. J and M. Segment JK with MN. Angle K with angle N, and those are all given, given, givens. And I'm proving JKL, JKL with MNO, MNO. -N 
and that's by angle side angle. Let's check it. J to M, JK to MN, K to N, JKL, MNO, ASA, given, given, given. That's it. All right. Thank you for watching. Let me submit this thing. And looks good. Thanks for watching.